Hey, um, so yeah, I finished this accessibility and I was really excited. And I actually started on Pride and Prejudice. This isn't actually my book, it's my teacher's book. She's super nice, and so she let me borrow it. Um, I am currently on chapter like nine or ten or something like that. Um, I really like it so far. It's really quick, even though I'm still already like. The chapters are really short, so they're like really quick paced, but I bet they'll start getting longer and longer. Um, yeah, I've watched the movie before, and so I'm finally excited to actually finally really read the book. So, again, I'm really excited for that. And then, also, now let's go back to Sense of Sensibility. I love Sense of Sensibility. It is a scale up from Northing at Abbey, which is her first book, and this is her second book. And so you can tell the progression, and I can tell the progression even in her third book. It is just amazing. I love her books. I love her writing. It's getting better and better. And this is why I like reading them in like made order, not necessarily published order. Um, yeah, it's really good. Like they're really good. And I know that sounds really weird to be like, they're just really good. But they are. And um, it took me a while to finish Sense and Sensibility only because I've been so busy. And I finally put my mind to it and I finally finished it and I was very proud of myself. Um, I did watch one of the movies, um, adaptation type thing, but it wasn't actually Sense of Sensibility, it was a modern retelling of Sense of Sensibility, and it was called Prada or Nada, Prada or Nada, something like that. It was on Netflix, it's not on Netflix anymore, but I watched it a while ago, and it was alright. I don't, I see the connection to Sense of Sensibility, but it isn't 100% there, if you know what I mean, it's not like, hmm. That's a good adaptation. But there are like just websites to tell you all the adaptations, which you can totally check out. Um, especially because I have the Kindle book, so there's like a link thing at the back where it has Liverbox um, recordings and like all that stuff. So I think that's really interesting and really cool. Um, yeah, just kind of my snippet-ish thing that I'm just gonna do for today. So yeah, I sound weird. It's really quiet. So it's Totally bothering me. Anyway, yeah, I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.